let's talk about this incident, this issue, this case, before I will finish my case, I'll finish my my broadcast in Chukuko Febu. Whom is now rotting in jail? I also want to appreciate Mazichi Kedozim, the head of the Rectorate of State of Indigenous People of Biafra. The Chukwu Kabiyama continue to bless you, sir. You are a good man. You may be silent, you may be gentle, you may be quiet, but you, I call you a silent achiever, the silent achiever, the gentle giant. That is what I call you. Chukwu Kabiyama will bless you. So my shout out today is going to you, Mazichi Kedozim. I'm giving you a, a special shout out because I knew how you started. I knew your story. I knew your history. You started from the from the grassroots, evangelizing in this in the streets of Europe for the restoration of Biafra. Before you finally became become the head of the Rectorate of State. Yesterday, I gave my shout out to Mas Benjamin Madubu. Today, I'm giving to you, Mas Chike Dozim. You are a good man. You may be silent in taking action. Sorry, you may be slow, not silent. You may be slow in taking action. You may be slow in responding, in responding to issues, but you are a good man. God will continue to bless you. You As you guys know that I always appreciate the media warriors. All the people that are broadcasting, showing their faces, and those that are on radio, including the comment section media warriors. I appreciate each and every one of you. But Ihanyam Miri, Afro Ihanyam Miri ni ruwa kukota. Ngure si data muade yura until the I saw something that made me to weep on internet today. Like, I was listening. I, I watched this video all over again. I couldn't comprehend. Then I realized the, 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 the amount of damage that Nigeria government did to us after the war. During and after the war. Then I, I begin to appreciate the effort of Mazen Namdekano and the indigenous people of Biafra more looking at what has happened to us. Looking at the amount of damages that was did to us. The reason why I put the picture of this Otondo here it's for you people to know that I have something to say about him. But the main, the main anger, the main problem that is bothering me, that brought me out this morning, this afternoon, this night, is the video I am going to play for each and every one of you that are watching this program this night. I am really the first time I'm watching here. I am really. Then, this man have children. This man have family members. This man that I want to talk about right now 
have extended families. I am just imagining how this man have deceived his family members, his extended families, his children with this narrative that I am going to destroy this night with evidence. It depends, it, it pierced my heart. It, in fact, Obawaramobi. And why it pains me the more is because I have met this man. I have seen this man, Korokuro, one on one. I saw this man visiting Mazen Namdekano. And I knew all this man have said about Mazen If I go to my archive, dear friends, if I go, go to my archive, I, I may be able to, I may, I may dig up a video recording I had about this same man when they visited Mazen Namdekano from Iguacha, which they fraudulently called the River State. I may find it. And I'm going to look for it in my, in my archive. Honestly, Obo Waramobi, a man that presented himself as Eze, king, with evil name, with the community where he come from, with evil name of community where he come from, stood before the camera and denied that he is not evil. Why we are fighting for the restoration of Biafra, we should also be fighting for the restoration of common sense of our people. Because the people I'm blaming on this whole problem is Ohane Zendibu, which after the war, they failed woefully to unite our people and educate our children. And that have led to so many damages that you are seeing today. So the topic I want to treat today says the failure of Ohanes and Dibu to unite all Igbos after the war through our culture and tradition it has caused a lot of damages in Igbo land. Number two says, Chukuka Chizorom of Febu is enjoying the bitter lesson. Because of the deception and divide and rule syndrome of the enemies of Ndibu in Nigeria. He is now in the prison, suffering for it. Third one says, Biafra restoration is the only hope for all Biafrans. The last but not the least says, Mazen Nam de Kano is not an ordinary human being. All his enemies are paying the big price today. Now pay attention. The reason why I always tell you to pay attention, if you have not shared this program, kindly share this program. Today's program is not for Basgos. Today's program is 100% for education, for information, for enlightenment, and for eye opening, destroying every fabrics of the enemies of uh, with 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 seed of discord, which they have sued, which have they sued in the heart of our people. That is why I'm here. So if you think if you are here, you think I'm going to deviate from this topic and talk about something else. No. And I'm not going to answer call today. Because sometimes people will leave, when you open your line for people to call in, they will leave the topic of the day, begin to say what is not in your agenda. Dear friends, I want you to pay attention to what I want to play now. But before I play it, let me tell you, let me give you a little intro. I want to also appreciate Mazi Chukwemeka, known as Namen TV. The guy who is doing the job of Ohanes Ndibu. 
the guy who is doing the job of Ibo Zurume, the, the guy who is doing, doing the job of Aki Kenga, the guy who is doing the job of Imo B, the guy who is doing the job of all Ibo social cultural organization, a single guy. Please, if that guy called for your, for, for your support, anywhere you see him, support him. He is indeed a hero, fighting to unify our people. He is the one that digged this up, because he is the one that went to River State, Iwocha, where he was interviewing an Igbo man who actually accepted and claimed that his name is Eze. Eze, did he say Euro Mania or something? Because I remember the day this man visited Mazen Nambikam. If you listen to him right now, but at the end of the day, he messed everything up. I believe that Mazichuko Meka will be disappointed seeing such man. I saw it on his, on his face. His facial expression shows me that he was dumbfounded and disappointed. Now pay attention and listen. We must continue to educate them. And when I am done playing this, I will now educate those people who are in who are in the same school of thought with this old fool. I call him an old fool. These are the if these are the kind of elders. Okay, no, 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 no. Because of the inchon chego and the enya, then my question is, where was his sense of reasoning when he visited Mazen and Kano as only in River State? But on this interview, this man is claiming Onyeche, not only. Then I'm going to educate him to tell him where Eche came from. Before I go on, let me play the video so that you may see. This is the video. Watch it. Okay, what I had. Ah, mo. Is a Dr. Clement Irobu. Is a Dr. Clement Irobu. And eba I know where Is a Dr. Clement Irobu. Are you listening? I, oh, shit. Not in other than Campbell, but in the under our Samelayalo, full of Nimelayalo. Oh, dear, call the Mazen and can go cast to get your tears. Hi, Zuanamni Zualamni as a Clement Irobu. Oh, okay. If they stumble on this program I'm doing now, they'll be 100 percent ashamed of you by the time I'm done schooling you and your generations. As a Clement. Irogu, Ireogu, Udo Manandi wana tuinu sina, Niroma ke ejuneji agano ogu. Mwama diya, Sonne miyabu Ireogu, Ona adu adu, Mwana ejune na gafia, Mwoji di Iroma. Obu nejune jiri Iroma, Omanga wuna ogu, Udo mifana ogu, Ogu na adu adu, Emu logu oruma, Emu logu ogu, 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 even flower Ige kosi kwa afya tu pa ya gani ru? Ode wutem ubi na bwam nanti? Dite ya wapa ya hani. Ah mo. Ibu kasi wili. Eze Dr Clement Irobu. Okay. Eze Dr Clement Irobu. An eba enowebe. Eba enowebe abu ala eberi omama. 
A very omuma. A river state. A river state. A very omuma. Okay. Um. Okay. Uh, uh, chief. Um. Here be dry. Here. Here be dry. I agala. A very omuma. A muro omuma. New states. No omuma no bala. New states. Eba kandi asibia. Eba kaswega. Eche. Eba o kandas wega eche o muma. Eba o muma ni mustet. Nambudi. Eba o kasi. Na kwa munti. Some of you jere na iya ine eme bi hu maazi. Iya ine ma bi hu maazi. Ka ine uko ku mwuro mwe. Ka ine ne uko ku. Mwko chigatu muna ye. Nde afula afu. Nde ne kota ge na habu ndi ibo. Nde ne kota na habu ndi biyafa. Nde fula ni sa goli isi. Makana wak madia mna fweba. Ama mna mugia na inu aga. Nili anya. Onye akari ana. Ye karire afo iri asa. Agadi woke na agu ofe chine ke ga poku. Ama mo onyo obo wafu gomi anya. Me pelonia. Se ni ya bo nye beri wa mama. Eze. Clement. Irogu. Na zi anonti konu nuzi honji na nani ya bonsi. Kambi ume bidi ya nisi ozo. Mbidi ozo. When I start it again, I will not interrupt until he finish. Pay attention. Bidi ya wapa ya hadi. Ah, mo. Eze Dr. Clement Irobu. Eze Dr. Clement Irobu. An eba eno webe. Ebe eno obo abo ala ebe eri omoma. Na adinvastate. Ebe eri omoma. Okay. Um, okay, uh, uh, Chief, come here, be dry. Here, here, be dry. I have gala, umpara, a bed, each each and all, river states. And, uh, in here, me, wo, I na cho, each ko, ibo, ono. Nde, wene, here, here, basari, ibo. Mana, I, 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 I conclude, uh, in Germany, in river states. Ya gawa, ebana, po, delta. Ebe, mo, kwere, onha, ma, ezi, ibo. So I told you, ma, ni bura ibeba. Iberi omo ma, awundi ibo, kwa hawagi. Inga sege, eberi, obezi anani landi ibo ba, okay. Anya bumi ibo, anya bu eche ethnics. Awunde eche, and eche no na river state. Ika kwa nampaure kie. Mwana ndi ibu baba. Ndanyake isi nina nina hapa. Ndiya sawazi ndi ibu. Hapo. State ya. Kwa kuna anukia. You have heard this old buffoon. You have heard this. Agadi chine kika boko. Agadi woke chine kika boko. Imagine what this man who is bearing is it. Is teaching his cabinet and the people following him. In English language, this man is literally telling us that he is from a Czech clan, not Igbo. That they have common boundaries with Igbo in a very moment. But they are that they are from a This man have denied. His original history and ancestral uh, lineage, which is connected to Imo State, which is Omuma in Imo State, the community of Huoposa Dimba. And there's another Omuma in Obala, in Imo State. Now, trying to connect himself, he's, he was running away from his original history. His original lineage, trying to connect himself with Eche, then getting to Eche, claiming again that Eche also have Igbo people that are close to them. Oh God, now man, I owe you a bottle of beer. Tomorrow morning, I'm going to give you a call. I'm in contact with you. I've been speaking with you before. I'm going to give you a call. I owe you a bottle of beer. For exposing this idiot, call himself Eze. Only a person, 
Ese que o chidurez e chico o bono na zia, no na zia na fa. O mundo em check go din this community be work as no boese. If this man gana agwa fa. Aga ma wea na ala tata. Work as si anya. O wea na ala. A wom wea na ala. A wom de kamilete na ala. A wom wea na ala. A wom ye ni ne so woka. Na kuko okolo. Ne punye ni akuko okolo. Woha nana. Wede zibia sahan miri. Eze Clement Irogu. Onye beri o muma. Na River State. Si ni abro nyibu. Ni abro nye che. In River State. O wobi wonye nzusu. Mfu no wa. Dika mwa mwa madi ya kulokuwa. Mwa bikonu. If you have another gadget that you are watching this program with, I want you to go to Google right now. Please, I beg you. You are going to do something. Experiment. The first thing I want you to do is to type on Google, when was River State created? When was River State created? You are going to see River State was created on 27th of May, 1967. Are you listening to me? On 27th of May, 1967, the same year that the war broke out, that is when River State created, was created. And the reason why this state was created is because you want to cut them out to say you are not evil. And in the year 1996, Bayelsa was created also out of River State. Are you listening to me? Now, what is the original name of River State? Iguocha, which is the language of the great Igbo people. Igwe Ocha is the name. The original name is Iguocha. You can type Iguocha on Google now. It will give you River State. It will bracket the Iguocha and give you River State. And the reason why it is called Iguocha is because of the sand that is found there. Very whitish in color. When you come out to claim that you are an elder, when some people say you don't respect elder, you don't. There are a lot of fools grow old and become elders. Thousands and millions of fools were elders. So when you meet such fool that have become an elder, you have to treat him as a fool. What I'm talking about here right now is about the race, the Igbos. And he's denying me he's not from Igbo. Now, I haven't told you when River State was created. This man is older than River State by birth. The man I'm talking about right now, he will be around 70, 70 something. I know him in person. He is older than River State. Before River State was created, who was him? Where, where did he come from? From Eche. According to him. <laughs> now pay attention. You see, this narrative and this deceptive uh, nar narrative that was given to these people have turned some of their children into behaving like animals. One of them is on the comment section right now. And I have to block him because he doesn't belong here. I have to block him. He doesn't belong here. He does not belong here. I have to block him. So let him come back with another 
fake account and comment. As a clear to see, Iro, Iro, Iro is older than River State. He should be around 70. And how old is River State now? Now he is claiming a chair. Let's follow him to a chair right now. Another thing I want you to check is who are the Eche people in River State? You can Google it yourself because sometimes when I do this kind of program, I want my viewers to follow me to check what I'm saying, to confirm what I'm saying. Who are the, who are the people of Eche in River State? Then let me explain. Eche, administratively known as Eche. The real pronunciation is Eche, E C H I E. But when they want to write it to make it not sound Igbo, they, they write it E T C H E. Eche is A G E A G E E. Eche. Manaya Grebabu, E T. C-H-E, a chain, because they changed the name. Just as they changed, they added R to Umu Okuta, they made it Rumu Okuta. Uh, Umu Adol, Umu Adol, they made it Rumu Adol. Umu Okoro, they made it Rumu Okoro, and they were claiming not Igbo. Now pay attention. Now, a chain administ administratively known as a chain is an indigenous Igbo group. An indigenous Igbo group, mostly found in the Niger Delta region of Nigeria. Presently, these people make up Eche and the Omuma, two of the local government area of River State. They can also be found in Ungoala local government and Omuma town, both in Imo State. <laughs> Hi, Chireke Nekweli Hojo. Hi, God, read the full of the number. The failure of our in Dimo to unite our people, to educate them after the war. Because what the Nigerian government did to us during the war was suing Biafra uniform to go to River State and begin to kill our people there, making them to hate Igbos because they were claiming that Igbo hate them, that they are not one with them. That is why this old man did not know where he come from, or rather he know and begin to pretend because he don't want to associate himself with his originality. And he was speaking the dialect of his ancestors, bearing the name of his ancestors. The community where he come from is the, is the community that bears the name of his ancestors. But yet, he is telling you that he is not Imo. Let me read that article again. He says, A chair administratively known as a chain, is an indigenous Igbo group mostly found in the Niger Delta region of Nigeria. Presently, its people make up of a chain and Omoma. That is where he comes from, from Oberi Omoma. <laughs> Two of the 23 local government areas of River State, they can also be found in Ungopala local government. There is a Beri Omoma in Ungobara, local government. The people of a chair in Ungobara, local government. And there are these people in Omoma town. Both of them are in Imo state. They migrated from here to there and they established. They still maintain their father's name, which is Omoma. A very Omoma. Then the people of a chair maintain their father's name, a chair. And the, for, by the creation of a state that was created in 1957, the, 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 the man from this particular community now is trying to tell you that he is not from there. But his name bears Igbo. His community represents Igbo, everything Igbo. And the day he came to Mazenan, he, 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 he presented himself as the leader of a group that came to see Mazen as Ndi Igbo in River State. That is my problem. That is my anger. I was there. What can I see? We were not talking. We were not doing no dog. I know you are going to. 
That is what happened to us. If not because of this struggle, I wonder how, ma how many million years it will take our people to be united, to understand who we are. So if you are from anybody from the place called a chain, if you are from anybody, any, if, you are, if you are anybody that comes from a place they call a burial moment, a river state, know you that Nibes Botoni, one for you, Bokaraka. You can find your ancestral home back to back to Ngopala or to Omoma, both in Imo states. That is your original ancestral land. If you extend this question by asking this man, okay, where did H.A. people come from? You will see him stammering. You will see him bluffing. Because he cannot explain. But here I'm giving his followers and his communities and uh, his children the information free of charge without how we can move Why won't you share this? Why won't you share this program? Because of people like this, a lot of evil have been done to our people. Let me play it for more once before I go to Chukwoko Fengu's case. Pay attention. Ah, mo is a Dr. Clement Irobu. Okay, is a Dr. Clement Irobu. And Eba I know Ebe. Ebe I know Ebe Ebe Ala Ebe Ri Omoma. Na River State. Ebe Ri Omoma. Okay. Um. Okay, uh, uh, Chief. Oh, my head, Peter. My head, Peter. I have Gala. I'm para Ebe Di Chiche na River State. And my head, I'm me wo. I'm not sure if you go. Ibo ono. Nde wene ihe ihe basari ibo. Mana ai ga ai ga conclude uh, njema ni na river states ya gawa eba na port delta ebe mo kure mohama ezibo. So I tell you ma ihe bura ibeba iberi omo ma awundi ibo kwa hawugi. Nga sege eberi. Okay, Arrala. Obe ze ana nyina ndi igbo ba. Okay, Arrala. Anya bu nyi igbo. Anya bu. Anya bu eche ethnics. Mono na su igbo. Ai. Afia bo fo. Awu nde eche. Afa nyi anki. Nde eche no na River State. Owo no si nyi anki. River State ekere. Ndi gbana mpa ore eche. Nyi ndi igbo ba. Ndanya ge si na nyina hapa. Bi asawa ze ndi igbo. Apo eh state ya. This is what the war have cost us. After the war, a lot of people denied of their ancestral home and their origin. Begin to answer names from different places. Begin to change their names. But the we will be telling you people the truth. Look at the age of this man, over 70 years. This man is older than River State is claiming that he came from a chain itself is talking about is part of people from Imo State. So, Parazian to learn, couldn't afford the kind of job Mazenan can do so far. As I'm doing this program, you are sharing it. It definitely it must get, get to one or two percent from a chain who is still believing that he is not Imo. Go there and see their name. I have a friend from a chain called Collins Chinedu. His English name is Collins. His Igbo name is Chinedu. They bear the same name. We share the same common value system, the same culture, the same tradition, the same attire, the same kind of food. But when you ask them, they will tell you they are not Igbo. Because of what Fulani have done among us. That is that for now. Uh, as a claimant, if you like, be only Fulani. It's not our problem. Now, I want to go into the issue, the case of Chukuka of Ebu. And I want you to watch and listen to him. Anybody that is fighting against Mazen Namdekano, know you that you are not fighting an ordinary human being. Anybody that is fighting this struggle, 
know you that you're not fighting just a struggle because you're fighting a design struggle that a lot of people is involved. Are you telling me that the blood of over 5.2 million people that died for the sake of Biafra will be in vain? Are you telling me that their spirit are not going to be working against you? Is that what you're telling me? Now pay attention and watch this. The many evil wars that led to the downfall of Ijele. If they leave Nam the town, me, I go fire eh, by no killing man to make I die. Now, federal government is the dicto. Me, I for no killing man by now. Eh, if I know, if I know, clap now, make all my children die before my eyes. Eh, you see, I swear on the earth, I'm out of court. I for don't kill him now, the time now. I for don't kill him, teams already. And at the same time, go deal with all these fools. You see, Emmanuel, I swear that because government never ready for them, I go scatter them. For the nature is so stupid, and his wife, Becky and for the nature, for the nature, don't that go fire you, fire your mama, don't that go be make there. They they say they, they don't say your your brother, Nami General, don't that we fire him if he involved himself in this case. Tell him say me, I say. Even you, even a dog, you can be the top dog in the earth, but even a dog has a law. I will tell his law, he will be the move from the military this year. Be you general, turn that fire, scatter your father, your mother, I will pay them to make a good in daughter. Okay. Um, you guys know that. Uh, I have dealt with this guy in the past. He threatened me, but he saw that I'm not someone to be threatened. This guy took my name. This guy you see, Chukuko Febu, you are seeing on the camera there, took my name to so many native doctors. Anywhere he gets, they tell him that this, this guy is untouchable. When you want to you get him to Winyaka. I really doubt with this guy. The day on on live program, I was in our mama. I the program. I don't know what moment I want there in here. Let me tell you people something. Oh, we find out what our chum no from or from no more on your book. Our world, Gobble, and that we are woke on a trachy. Oh, you know, we're gonna chug it. Oh, I forget, but I'm a man of go, Guinea and a bachelor. Um, oh, on a trachy, go and be up to war. Oh, when they will this guy, you know, who took off him, Choromian, you know, will keep him no war. Oh, go on, look out within the full and in the Abakiar and Andotia. All this guy lead the team, get on a bit by the Stefan in Chukwejo for. Buy on the Oku, buy so many houses, Oku. This guy only deny a capital to cook off him. This same to cook off him only deny a capital no one. And one you are talking on the ground of IPOB family meeting. Now, but some people are betrayed. Yeah, church is betrayed. The struggle. See, you make me a bit warm. But the moment they put their foot up, they are going to make a change. They are going to make a change. Because some people are going to make a change. They are going to make a change. They are going to make a change. As you see, we're in John now. We're going to go home. We're going to go home. If we're going to go home, we're going to go home. 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 That is the kind of human being I am. You may not like it, but that is the truth. This guy, we're going to go home. 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 We're
BA that is Stephen Chukwu Ejiofon. Why happen when you are going to kill the abu? See any memo to buy your condo alive? They point him alive. This guy only now get out of Chukwu Kofi. I know Jiemon. Oh God. Adam e gosi unu ebe chukwu kofi ebu potara. Ebe ono na IPOB family meeting. I will show you where he he was swearing that he will never betray Ali. He will never betray any this this struggle. That any day you do that, that chukwu kebe man should kill his children. And my problem is that he used to bring his children into his mess. On as you jail, on as and corners and cause a cable on a keeper. I'm not born. I'm coming there. Now, after all his threats against me, he will do this, he will do that, he will buy me, he will kill me, he will do. My problem with him even started from the one you call Master Prophet platform. I had, there was a program that Master Prophet was doing. He brought this idiot, this Nikonpo, this buffoon, into his program. And opened his line, asked Biafrans to come in and ask him question. Why is he attacking Mazin Nandekano? That was before Mazin Nandekano kidnapped. Yes. So many things has happened. So you know that this screen now doesn't watch my time. But I want to do this because if I don't do this, it is it is not going to be properly in my own record. I have spoken about him in the past, but I think I use him to teach some people lesson. That is why I come out to announce and say, anybody who is planning or ganging up against the leadership of IPOB, you will not live to see the end of this year. So when they tell you that somebody is ganging up through our attitude, through our countenances, you will know those who may do it and those who may not do it. Because the only thing they use in this struggle to destroy somebody's reputation is blackmail. But when people are pointing at you, saying you are going to do this, the only thing for you to do, whether you, you mean it or you don't mean it, open your mouth and pronounce a word against that thing that they are talking about. So far, your heart is clean. Just walk, walk, walk. As I'm speaking now, you can look one, there are Guiding and ministerial angels that are listening and marking everything I'm doing. The spirit of those that died in the struggle are taking note of what I'm saying. I still repeat what I said on my platform that anybody that is planning any evil against the directorate of state of this movement, anybody that is planning any attack against the directorate of state of this movement, and anybody that is planning to frame anybody up, be it a member of the Rhetoric of State or the floor members of the struggle, may that person not leave to see Biafra. Because deep room is said. So Chukwuko Afoebu led the troop that went to Ejofo's house. Camera captured him. Camera picked him. CCTV picked him up. His face is in the archive of Barestifa Yichuku Ejofo as one of the people that brought the enemies to come and kill our people there. When you begin to fight against your own people, when you begin to kill your own people, 
because of peanuts that the enemies are giving to you, they will use you. After using you, they will destroy you completely. Now, I want you to pay attention to what Chukukofebu have said when he was pretending to be part of the struggle in Turkey. You have to listen to him. You must listen to him before I give you lowdown about his current situation. Because when you, when the enemies use you to kill your own people, you betray your own people, they will never trust you. Now, listen to him. Yes, you know, an attack on IPO. No, no, I'm talking. I said, pray to him. Uh, it is criticism of policy from criticism of the goal. That policy and tactic on the TV versus. Sometimes when I look to you, you for the last year, if you are against IPO, if you are against the people, you are a sabotage. How can I sabotage my own people? I think I don't And the worst thing that could happen to a father or a woman is the child is the father. But so we make So in our job, it is a People will know I want to criticize the policy. I want to criticize this in a statute. I think so long that work. Not generally that they criticize it, the, the actualization of Biafra. Nigeria broke on the woman. I wouldn't be here. Okay. In my own world, Nigeria, they will be on that watch. Since Nigeria had that work. But I like to say it's man, I'm going to get there. If you don't criticize that from the people who are in line, they will be around there, they will be that. No, that's not me. That's not me. Because can you about this now? Okay. I, I believe that you guys have listened to this. So many of you have seen it before. I decided to talk about him today. I decided to bring it out once again because some of you have forgotten. In English explanation of all this buffoon have said that he was criticizing the struggle. Not that he doesn't like the struggle, that if Nigeria is good, he will not be in Turkey. By then, he was in Turkey. And he swore that any day he spoke against the struggle or against Ndibo, let his children never recognize him. That the worst thing that will happen to any father is for his children not to recognize him. He was playing smart. I expected him to say, let him die. The way I used to swear. Have you ever heard me swear with my children? No. Let anything I do, let me pay the penalty. Let me get the penalty. Not my innocent children who have committed nothing. So most of the times, anytime you see somebody that says, if I do this, let my children do this. If I do that, let me... That person is a liar on a toashi. I don't like it. But people use their children to cover up. Your, ch your children are not the one that committed the crime. They are not the one that is being accused. They are not the one that is taking the oath. It is you, and you must use your head to carry it. So the first time I listened to this, I canceled that declaration upon your children. And I reversed it and said, it is you that will never be recognized in your life in Alibu.
any day you go against neighbor or against the struggle itself. There are so many videos you have made against the struggle. This guy has led Ibubago and some police officers to so many communities and burnt people's house down. This guy, you see. This guy has killed so many people in Ali. And some people were clapping for him, saying, Jerry, rise up. Jerry, wake up. Jerry, we are supporting you. A riffraff is bearing the name Ijele. He doesn't know the meaning of Ijele. A failure. He failed as a human being in Libya, where he was doing throwaway, where he was doing human trafficking. I have record of that. And I'm going to play it here. A lady who knows him 100% is supposed to him. The lady even called on one of my programs sometimes ago. When I wanted to confront him to lie and he with facts and figures, he ran away. And that was the beginning of my problem with the man we call Pyon Jong Ho, Master Prophet. The unfortunate in law of Mazenan Kanu. Because this man opened his platform and brought this Iberi man for people to call in and question him. I called in, I respected him, the host. And I said, please give me time that I may speak to this man and ask him questions. Let him be answering me. That you shouldn't allow this guy to intimidate you. Because what I notice is when you want to ask him a question, he will shout on him and say, I don't want this person. And because this man was looking for money, Master Prophet was looking for money. He monetized his page. So he wants everything that will, that will make his page to be stable and uh, working. But me, I was coming with bomb shell. I was coming with atomic missile. That uh, that one of those those one those uh, uh, bomb that was dropped in Hiroshima and Nagasaki is what I brought to his platform. And this crook quickly noticed it and ran away. He noticed it and he ran away. Now let me show you, because all the man to get a coron and go see here. Look at it. This is me. This is me here. Mama, good afternoon, sir. Hello, this prophet. Is him. This is, this is. This uh, is. Uh, 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 yeah. Hello. Go ahead. Yeah. 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 Please, the people from the phone. This thing will not be smooth. Please, you better join us. Direct. We're having almost five hundred. I calls. use myself as example. I'm in going to turn the phone down. Struggle. Please, yeah. go ahead. Go ahead, my brother. I can hear you speak. Okay, um, thank you. Thank you. Prince Dalentin, Prince Dalentin, to you. Um, I, I watched your program yesterday mm -hmm. with um, traditional old mm -hmm. and this morning I see that you are. I see that you are on with Mazi Chukuka of Ebu. Mm -hmm. And um, I decide to, I have questions to ask him. And um, Go ahead. I want Go. to thank you for what you are doing, mm -hmm. but please mm -hmm. don't allow him to intimidate, don't allow him to keep intimidating you into pushing word into your mouth, not allowing you to say what you want to say. Because if he does that to other people, he cannot do that to me. At all. So I come to ask him only but few questions. And when I ask him a few questions, I would like him to answer me correctly. Okay. And if you have anything he wants to say in response, he will respond to me. Yes. If I am not given this opportunity, then you can take me out. Okay. I beg that you give me the opportunity to ask him questions. Uh, and thank you. Okay. Go ahead. The Should I go ahead? ahead? Go ahead. Let me, Master Prophet, let me, let me say something. Mm -hmm. You should not use him asking any question any further because you have started uh, in bad faith, okay? We let him right ask away. the question and answer himself. I'm not <laughs> going to waste my time on him. Okay, my brother, bye-bye. You see, 
Do you see where I <laughs> fell? I fell out with the master prophet. On this program, this guy was busy intimidating all the callers. He doesn't allow anybody to ask him any question. Once he asks him any question, he cannot answer. He begins to, to, to chance Master Prophet. Say, Master Prophet, take this person. This person cannot be answering this kind of question. But our in an open platform for debate, people should ask their question. So because of what I have seen that they have been doing to other people, that is why I started to lay the foundation because I looked directly to his and said, allow me, I beg, I plead that you shall allow me. Do not, but if you cannot, then you take me out. That is to say that you don't want me to ask my question. And Master Prophet kicked me out. That was my problem. We are my problem started with him. But Chukuka, Chukuka Febu, ran away. He ran away from the question I wanted to ask him. And Chile can no any way or Goriana Onana, more blue oversize. Oh, man, me and a moon, you know, my name. Naturally, I'm not this guy, me in that platform that very day. And my joy is that another guy called Chidera later called on his platform and finished him completely with facts and figures. Today, on an hour, I'm saying, see, I want to lay a foundation to tell you. A little story that some of you do not know about him that you need to know before I will now talk about the, his present situation because he's enjoying so much now. I heard that he's enjoying in that uh, dungeon. This guy, Chuku Kofebu, happened to be one of the people that are doing uh, uh, that are into human trafficking. And a certain lady that knows him from Libya made a program and explained how Chukuko Febu was collecting money from women, sending them to for prostitution, and sending them for to Euro for prostitution, collecting money from them. And he failed in that business. Let me tell you. When you are when you are destroyed spiritually, there's nothing you can do physically that will that will work. Because this guy I'm talking about now happened to be a courtist. He's a courtist in Enugu State. In case you don't know, Chuku Kofebu happened to be a courtist in Enugu State. He killed somebody in Enugu in a suit and ran away. His parents live in Onicha. His parents live in Onicha. Over Mado. And though the Corporonia home will naturally let me tell you, there's nothing this guy can do in this life to succeed. Nothing. If you like, give this guy a private jet, give him one billion ten hundred billion dollars. Chukuko Febu will still become a nuisance. Because the person who was in school, when he was in school, the blood is after him. Ebony be caught. Oh, but also it's a dropout. Baratonicha. Batonicha will lay property papier. The only pa land papier were no buku. The only land his father had in no buku. He sold it. Family property. Then he ran away to Libya. Getting to Libya, he began to do. Uh, Straw away. You begin to do horoscope. This guy you are seeing on this screen. I know his story. I know his history. You see, in this struggle, sometimes when I speak, it will look as if I'm boasting. I'm not boasting. I personally sponsored somebody that went to know his father's house and his father's shop. In on the father was a kabu kabu uh, taxi driver. The mother have a have a shop. Ebony le ifen me. Only one nenaya here. I grow na go the parents. My the the the, the shockiest part of the whole story is that the father happened to be a lover of Mazenam and an IPOB member in on the 
He weakens me. Yes. I didn't matter the job table you are So don't you if you deal with you, I will know how I'm dealing with you. The father deny yes, me and one money deny you come in a bros one. It's no longer my son. The boy the man that we have for senior chipota apron, chipota legaria, chipta yen in a cousin and I will remember. Who on a family meeting about the gym meeting now no no nature? Then it was a report, Ika Gum. Ika Gum, see, eh? No, you see, the reason why I told you that anybody that is that you you are, you are accusing and the person is swearing with his children, don't trust the person hundred percent. Let the person use his head to swear. Just the way I used to do. I will not take any unnecessary cost to my children or my children's children. No, let it be upon me. What I commit be upon me. So Chuku Kofebu, I knew him to grassroots. That is why at a point of chapter number, I did a pro only program earlier. a program back, back and front, back and front, back and front. At the time, he will understand that I am not somebody who can push up. He, he cleared for me, he stopped talking about me. Then once he stopped talking about me, I've already given him the heat of his life. I left him and continued with the real message that I was preaching. Now, I want you to pay attention to what this lady, that new to book of one-on-one in Libya said. Pay attention. A short video before I go out this afternoon. I'm on break before I go back to my work. So, the reason why I'm making this uh, live video this afternoon, please, whenever you see this video, Share it. It's because of uh, this guy they call uh, Ijele. Ijele. Ijele that stays in the, in Turkey. Ijele. Oh my God! can put on Facebook this afternoon. Iye garaga mbumbu. Iye put on a Libya. Iye men a Libya. About ten years ago, nange put on ya. Ijele, it's not more amagi na Libya. Ijele, it's not more amagi na Libya. about what this angry lady is talking about, this man you're looking on the screen. He knew this guy. As at the time she did this video, she was mentioning about 10 years ago that this guy used to bring people from, bring ladies from Nigeria and sell them to uh, $2,500 to Arab guys for prostitution. Like he will bring you to Libya then collect two thousand five hundred dollar per head of a womb of a lady. Then sell them to Arab people. Arab people will now put them in a place they call connection house and begin to use them for prostitution. You see, internet never forgets, and whatsoever evil anybody does, we wait for them. I pray any evil I do, let it befall me. Let it not go to my children. Because my children are innocent. And whatever my children do, do, let it be on their own head. This guy was bringing people from Nigeria to Libya and selling them $2,500. This, this lady here know, knew him one-on-one. -on -one. And this lady was very angry that he, her own sister was killed. She died in Libya because of the people like Chugu Kofebu who are using our girls for prostitution. 
He, she made mention of names of people that are in, are in the same cartel with Shugu Kofebu, doing the same business. The same guy you are seeing today. So when you see him suffering, and some people are coming and say, hey, free Shugu Kofebu, free jealous speak, they don't know who he is. You need to share this program. That some of those non-entities, low-life men and women that are asking free Chukwu Kofebu, how many of them anyways? How many of them are talking about his freedom? That they may know the evil that this guy has committed. And the, the, the oath he put upon himself is working on him, not on his children. I don't want to go in details about his marital life, his children, and what have you. No. I just want to dwell with what the evil that this guy has done. Pay attention to what this girl is saying.
and we expose, expose you people. Do you know what they call women in Libya? They call them printing machine. And they draw to her. They were printing to I escaped my life because they wanted to poison me. Because I'm not going to be here. I'm not going to be here. I'm not going to be here. Just imagine. I'm not going to be in Nigeria. I'm not going to be here. 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 I was in Aliga. It was a slam at the house. It was up to her. Never let up to her. A woman, I saw them, I saw them now. I saw them now. Oh, that's why I moved. I better think of a young woman. I'm not in Aliga. Oh, I better think of it. I see a toy of asthma. 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 She's a muscular. I see a fish muscular. Hem she was, hem she was a raggy. Hem she was a raggy. The man made it the meal of hem she was a raggy. Um, for those of you who are somehow sympathetic to what this EU Watch, yeah, I think you have watched this lady. You have heard what this lady said. They are bringing women from Nigeria and selling them, using them for prostitution. And they are into wash, wash business. 419. But upon that, Shukuka have not prospered, have not made money from all that. Upon all this illegal, dangerous woman trafficking business that this guy have indulged in, he haven't made any. It's okay when one block up on a bend near. Those of you that live in in Libya, I begin to go to confirm. They bring you from Nigeria, tell you they are going to give you a job. You come to Libya, they put you in a in a connection house, then collect two thousand five hundred dollar. The less again. Onye another onye onye Nigeria. Onye Nigeria was a less easy onye ra. Onye ra zewo 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 from there. Me loga. So many people passing through this Libya cannot give birth again. So many women who are prostit who are who have done prostitution in Libya, they cannot give birth again because of the kind of the, because of the way that the Arab guys use them. They use less their life. Some of them they will be trying to bang one because they use less. You will see a woman. You will see a woman. You think that this woman is so? It's a woman. It's not a woman. It doesn't have a womb again because of what he have done in Libya. Because of the dirty life she have lived in Libya. This gay confessed. He said that they are using foam. They will put. Make it hot. Use it to be having sex with women. Foam. Useless in them. And this is somebody who later find himself in to Libya to to um, Turkey. Getting to Turkey. In Libya, he did not prosper. He did not make money. He managed to escape to Turkey. He got to talk. He, he couldn't get paper. He did not get. He did not have paper. He couldn't make money. He was into drug business in Turkey. This guy Yifu Chukuka in Nigeria was into drug business in Turkey. There's a video of him that was online, where he was discussing deal with somebody about drug in Turkey. Yet he did not make money. Chukuka Chukuka cannot boast of one thousand dollar where he was in in Turkey. Because the father have cost him. Because the, the family of that person, Chukukaburu, in a school, the blood of that innocent person, Noburu, is still following him. This is somebody that some people are coming out to say, free, jelly. Free. I listen to one, a mommy and my boy in Kabo, Tana Kogiri. Yeah, it is IPOB that is holding the jelly. Chinook, all welcome. Now, because of his activities in Turkey, 
after taking this oath, swearing that he's not going to do anything against Ndibu, he turned against IPOB in Turkey. I don't want to go in detail to tell you what, what happened that makes him to begin to fight against us. Begin to insult Mazen Namdi Kami. Before you say, I go, I go, I go, I go, I say, for your man, do and what I want to do, I need to want to not feel you on even the day that he was invited in the police station, he went there, he was with his, with his phone. He wanted to stay there and be doing... This guy... He was like, I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm in police station. Guys, calm down. Nothing is, not, I'm coming out. Nothing will happen. Nothing will happen. Nothing will happen. They deport to him. For you people to know that Fulani knows how to play the, the dirty game. The ticket about this guy was rooted to Lagos. Men on a Lagos nature yeah, continue she. Mando Rego Hana Libya. Mandi up up room one now in Libya. Destroy the life of their sister. Mandi IPO be in do almost your case na 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 period na be na talking. And on a chair and airport. I told God. Then Fulani saw him as a potential Agent to work against Ndibu. Through the embassy, Nigerian embassy in Turkey, they changed his ticket to Abuja. And then now Lagos, Lagos, Nigeria, he really threw his ticket to Abuja. So then they brought it Abuja came to Nigeria. Go and then Abuja was working and they they fully prepared. They can move here. Because when he was fighting IPOB, they were communicating with him, telling him, don't worry, we are with you. He forgot what happened to to, to uh, Kenule Ken Saroruwa. He forgot what happened to Isaac Adakaburu. He forgot what happened to Harry Marshall. But today, really seen. They took, they collected him, they took him Rented house for him, feeding him, giving him money. I told him when he when he touched ground, he said, "Yeah, he's going to show you paper. You're going to do this." I told him, "So, God, the way you will die, your death will be very, very shameful because the the death of a hen will be better than yours because I got funded buraku ka funded riya funded tarane of your own wo yega mama kani. Nobody will talk about you." They will just kill you and bury you. When they use you finish, they kill you and bury you. This guy had been insulting Mazen Nandikano mother, insulting Mazen Nandikano, insulting Mazen Nandikano children, insulting his wife, insulting every IPOB member, cursing us. And this is somebody who, who say he's, he cannot do such a thing against his own people. And he begin to brag. He brag a lot. He said, Bragado. When you see him bragging, you think he can do something. Those people who are using him, or brag, you don't go brag, you don't cost Paul and Nature, cost a Bukobi, cost Oyedepo, cost uh, uh, what is his name again, cost uh, um, um, including Oyaki Lome, all the old pastors in Nigeria, cost Chana Hanine, threatening them that he's going to kill them, saying what he can, what he cannot do in one million years to come. For me to be to act like if as if as if Nigeria belonged to his father. Even uh, 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 Jeremiah, Omoto Fufuye, he was costing him, fumbling, making mouth that he, they cannot do him anything, that he is the king of the game, that he is Udele for a reason. This guy, you see. I will not even forget to tell you when Mazen Nandikano and IPOB appear in court. This guy organized Fulani boys. Started protesting against IPOB, against the Biafra This guy you see. Because Omore Ofi Long Abraham Nandi. That is what this idiot you see here have done. He was even boasting that Mazen Nandikano is going to die. He's going to kill Mazen Nandikano. That Mazen Nandika will die in prison. This guy, you see. Will I forget when him and Chukuma, in case in the Afiabo 
uh, what is that is guy name? Chuku Madike. They went to British Embassy in Abuja to protest against IPUB and against Mazenam. This guy you are looking at now. Now what happened? When you go against your own people, when you sin against the gods of the land where you come from, your life will be useless. If anything happened to you, the people that are supposed to ask of you will not show face. And that is what is happening to him today. Cyber stalking and cyber bullying is what they gave him as a charge. And there are pack and pack and pack of cases that is waiting for him. The whole world is speaking for Mazen Namikano. Mazen Namikano is not happy and he gave him Mazen Namikano. This man, so if they leave him, that the, the team is already that is going to need to own the name with this model. Excuse me. What I tell you, go cross in the game. We are only crossing the game. We are threatening people's life on the internet. This guy called Chukuka, you are looking at now. Today, where is him? Where is those full? Where are those full and men that I were telling him right on usually that we are paying him? Where are they? For me, information we had. How will you go from my own house on a new one? What are from the information I know? Yes, to who come with a and I was a girl, but I'm not a mammon. I was a coin for land, but for who? What are you? This guy cannot go to his to his family house to his village alone. He was go with a note in the key in the next year. This guy, you see. This guy has burnt so many people's houses, leading the squad that burnt people's houses. And he's fumbling, he's making mouth with it. In an Igbo, lying against IPOB, saying all manner of lies against IPOB, even going to a radio station to testify against Mazen Namikan to say that Mazen Namikan is the, is, the, is the leader of a non government. This guy you are looking at now. Today, we are seeing. I want to use this guy case to remind anybody that is planning or kicking against the restoration of Biafra or against Mazen Namika. The reason why I am showing his picture, why talking about him, is for you to know that I know him very well. This guy has committed a lot of atrocity in our land. And those people that we are telling him, right on, right on, where are they? I heard that they have given him bail on the first case that is answering because they have almost more, another four or five cases to answer. On the first one, they have given him bail. Do you know the, the bail condition? 50 million cash. And uh, someone that will sign for him will be someone that has level 14 in civil servant. And the person must have a property that is worth 5 billion. Two, two people that will sign for him. You must have a, 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 five, a property that is worth 5 billion in Lagos. So 10 billion properties are, the short, uh, are what the shortest are going to present. And 50 million naira uh, cash uh, bell price. And I asked my, myself question. All his followers, have they been able to raise up to 1 million naira? No. For me, information, what they have raised for him is 750,000. <laughs> Now, 
yen joku ya mama kuhu kana magari kuna masina kana magari we ipo bina magari uchunu dia because kesi chuku kofia buga unu gana au gana angwala na kesi unu chavu fifty thousand kwa as na high risk tego nde wana tui tui yego mani yeni ru fifty million that is to say how long have you been in the in the cell now in 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 in, in the prison now I think three months and above since March, March, April, May, June, July. Okay, June is three months plus, and they were able to raise only seven hundred fifty thousand. That means if they can be raising seven hundred fifty thousand for every three months, if you divide it into fifty million, you tell me how many years is going to stay there before they will bail him, and to get someone who is having level fourteen in civil servants. A senior civil servant with level 14 with property worth of 5 billion. Do you people know that they took the case to the king in Amanduba? The traditional prime minister in Amanduba, where he came from. The man said, I don't know this person, no, I don't know this man. They denied him because they cannot provide that kind of amount of money. If you sell all the whole land, in Hinama and Duba, his village, you will not get uh, five billion. But this is somebody who came out and begin to ferment evil, begin to ferment rubbish. They to I will kill you, I will do this, I will buy you, I will do this. The, the worst is that he was even telling, uh, saying that any day that a uh, 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 Paul Eneche or Ebuko will come to his house with police, that they will shoot gun, tire. He said they will shoot gun, their bullet will finish. That men deal with him, we go, we go, we go pull the, the, their trigger against against Nigeria police that will come and arrest him. But the day they arrest him, this is how he was moving, like a pussycat. He was trying to hide the handcuff. He couldn't hide it. You have betrayed their people, betrayed their, their father, betrayed their mother, betrayed their brothers, betrayed their sister, betrayed Njibo. So when Njibo got put aside in all of the initiates, he got him wherever he was. Because nobody is coming for you. So when you see people that are protesting, say three, Jerry, speak, send this video to them, that they may watch to see the evil of this guy. That is the truth. For the information that is reaching us, we heard that last three weeks that he fainted three times. <laughs> King of the game. Is fainted in the prison. Mazin Nandekan have been under incarceration in DSS dungeon for two years plus. And Mazin Nandekan did not give up. Mazin Nandekan did not fail one day. Mazin Nandekan was not wicked. Mazin Nandekan was still standing strong, speaking, telling you what he used to say from the beginning. Until they gave him bail. Now they have held him down for another three years. Have you ever seen Mazen Nandekan shaking, pretending like he is sick in the hospital, in the in the court? No. But today they have fainted three times. Ah, ah, I heard that you they fainted. Fainted at him. Fainted at him. Can you see I was here? Fainted him. I wore a mirror. 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 that the people that he hoped upon have disappointed him. The people that we are using him, telling him, go ahead, we are with you, have failed him. The only people he have that he's supposed to have are his people that he has been fighting against, destroying and burning their houses, killing their children. That is the truth now. You want to argue it? That when you sell your brothers, even the buyers will never trust you. If you if you if you betray your brothers, the person that buy you that you that you betray your brother gave will never trust you. Because if you can betray your brothers, there's no how you cannot betray the same person that gave you money. There's no guarantee. 
So finally, finally, the current story we are hearing now is that no Abuja but no one. As long as but no one, then the question is not just Obogi image here. Obogu kidi niya. Obogu pata go long siya. Every year you see a nono pata mba. Until Obogu yenda ni no. I remember that nobody will give Obogu. This guy is evil. This guy has killed a lot of people in Anibu. This guy has destroyed a lot of houses in Anibu. So all those people who are talking, uh, free chicken, chicken, coffee, make you not do much now. Make you not match out. Let us see. Make you not match out. Roll yourself out. Let us see how many you are. Now, let me say this. I don't want to compare myself with the rabble rouser. As I am today, I am a member, I am a Biafra, and an IPOB member. A PA, personal assistant to Mazen Nandekami. If anything happened to me today in this struggle, the world will ask of me. Thousands and millions of Biafrans will rise up to talk about me. If anything happened to me, you know why? Because I have never betrayed my people. Because I'm fighting for the goodness of my people. Because if, any, if whenever I see evil that want to befall my people, I stand up to fight it. That is what makes me different from him. For him, he has killed his own people. He has destroyed his own people's properties, lives and properties. He has betrayed his own people. He has taken his own people for granted. Sold them. So now that the, the that the, the government that is what he was fighting for are holding him. He thought that Buhari government is going to remain there forever. Buhari government have come and gone. Now Tinubu government is involved. They are invoked. So there's no way you can turn the hand of clock to have the set of people that were supporting you when you were betraying your own people. It's a very big lesson that each and every one of you watching this program should learn. If you don't want to learn in a, in a soft way, you learn in a hard way. So, Udele, Kanonime, Nakoya, Anoga Korea, Lunisi. Let me declare a word that Chuku Kofebu will remain in prison and Mazenan Kanu will come out. Chuku Kofebu will remain inside that prison. And Mazenan Kano will be a free man. Like a free man, freedom without anything attached to it. Unconditional freedom, release, is what Mazenan Kano is going to get. Nothing like bring somebody that has a level 100 in, 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 no, 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 to come and say, no, no, nothing like that. Unconditional. Because appeal court have declared it. Supreme Court have testified that he have committed no crime. But let him go and answer whatever they were putting on him. Which I know is a way to say, leave this man. So those of you that are fighting against Mazen Namikano, know you today that whom you are fighting against is not an ordinary man. And I want to use this media to speak because I'm an oracle. I speak for the gods, that mankind, humanity may listen. And each time I talk, if you don't want to listen, it's up to you. But if you listen, put it somewhere in your brain. Put it somewhere in your heart. It will definitely come to fruition. That is how I told you all the things that are happening in this struggle, and they're happening. Mark today's date. Mark today's date. We are already on 30th. Because this is 12 at 8 a.m. in Jefala, being Sunday, 30th of June. When well, Mazen Nandekano is free, there are inner kakus that Mazen Nandekano trusts that are going to fight Mazen Nandekano when he come out. Inner kakus. Then I'm going to come out. When Mazenan can come out, I repeat, when he come out, there are inner kakus that will fight him. They will fight him. 
but they will fail. If we're going to get away, so get ready when it starts happening. On this platform, I see the hope. <coughs> Excuse me, I'll still come to tell you, didn't I tell you? In Akakus, there will be a battle between Mazen Namdekan and some people from the Inner Kakus. It will happen. Ego Sigumia, don't, don't come to ask me who told you. Nobody told me anything. It is, I have seen it. And it is going to come to fruition. And when that time comes, that is when you will see the other side of Mazen That is where you are going to see the other side of me. So if you are part of the people that are planning when Mazenan can come out, that you are going to form a gang that will battle him, don't forget that I'm here. I will be here. He used to cook off able to learn a lesson, to know that there are people you cannot speak against and go scot free. It may take little time, and it will come to play. The world will see it. And you, that is planning evil against Mazo Oles, it could be Ken. Because he gives you an asylum. In as much as my hand is clean, in as much as I don't have any part in heart against anybody, anybody that is planning evil against me shall reap evil in double faults. This is what I want to say. And this is what I, where I want to bring this program to an end. As you know, after that, as if you age, 4 4 4 I greet you all. Thank you so much for watching. I will not open line for calls. It is late already. Can I say